Yep. <clears throat> hey guys, um, thank you so much for being here and very honored to join this session. Uh, let me share my screen first. Um, can you see it? Perfect. Um, so um, nice meeting you all. My name is Block Mia, and I am the community manager of Mystical. And we are um, a multi-chain privacy um, SDK uh, as, as a service for developer and user with a compliance feature. And I would like to share more about our views on um, how privacy should work in Math3 and how we could and how Mystical use innovative um, design to balance the demand of user privacy and compliance requests. So uh, let me give you guys an intro of what Mystical is and also give you a, a demo, the live demo of um, of Mystical product, uh, which has been live for three months since, since um, April this year. So to begin with, why uh, the couple of features, why, why we're building Mystical is because, um, and, and it's because we think that privacy is the fundamental need for all users, whether it's Web2 or Web3. However, in the nature of Web3, um, in particular, when all the financial transaction records are on chain, it is transparent. However, for a lot of users, not everybody is really comfortable sharing their everyday payment or trading or transaction history to the world. So a reasonable privacy is definitely the demand that we could serve to the Web3 community. But uh, what features do we need in this privacy, fee uh, in this privacy solution? for general uh, financial services. Um, we think that first of all, it should be um, multi-chain, meaning that all users and developer on, on, on different chain could be able to activate the privacy solution that we're building. Um, and they could be the really simple add-on for all DeFi projects and for, for all financial infrastructure when their users need privacy. Um, so the first feature for Mystical is that it's a multi-chain um, protocol that could support both developer and users on different chain. And so far, Mystical has been live on Ethereum, Binance Smart Chain, Polygon, Avalanche, Moonbeam, and 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 for layer two, we are on Base. So Mystical has already been really actively uh, providing privacy features um, and privacy solution for a lot of um, developer on all this chain. And um and the the reason why we are looking into uh that there are there are there are other features that um for mystical to work on is that um it's a is, is we're using ck technology to make sure that the whole transaction is um uh, the whole transaction we are the way that the design of mystical is that we are using ck technology the braid transaction link between the sender and the 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 receiver um so fundamentally um all the and and, and in this transaction design um everybody not everybody but like a lot of ways for the participants to get engaged and also while they're using and generate and and and, and receive all of this um and receive revenue in this protocol uh for example if you act as a, a zk miner or a zk relayer um the users will be able uh and you will be able to share the transaction history uh, sorry the transaction revenue uh in mystical um and for, for each user um and we think that the market is really big um in this in this privacy feature uh, for the privacy market um for example when we're looking at all this compliance um, when we look at all the the potential users and clients in Web three is growing really strong, but there are not a lot of really good, um, there are not a lot of really good application layers for for privacy. Uh, for example, like at the moment, it's either, it's either sorry, uh, it's either a, a layer one or layer two that will force all the users, and uh, moving to, uh, a new chain to build from scratch. Or is an individual uh, wallet, for example, like Tornado Cash, that allow user only working on uh, you, you providing privacy using privacy feature on a certain chain, and it's and for example, it's only supporting either Ethereum or Binance Smart Chain. So that's why uh, Mystical is hoping to ultimately use the thing that we have already built to serve all the bridge partner, the Dex, 
and and payment partner and wallet partner um so that like all our partners will not need to worry about if they understand privacy or cryptography or zk but to simply activate the protocol that mystical has been has been building um, and we could serve as the fundamental um, privacy layer for all of this protocol and the last thing we would like to mention is that we do aware in the current financial compliance environment, um, everything is getting um the price, uh, regulations are getting closer up on, on all the privacy feature uh, for, uh and the web three the DeFi application and in particular the ones with privacy feature for example mid last year, um Tornado Cash was sanctioned by OFAC because they support allegedly they supported, uh, money laundry and. Uh, illegal transaction from hackers. So we think we believe Mystic believe that there shouldn't be any conflicts between user privacy and 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 compliance. And we do believe that um we a healthy and sustainable web privacy solution should be uh balancing the privacy for the good without providing privacy for the bad. So in the design of mystical uh, we actually have a, a particular compliance feature that uh, allow, although like we we that allowed authority to check out certain transaction if it has been proven to be illegal or malicious. So and the way to review this transaction, but it doesn't mean that Mystical open a back door for all these authorities. Instead, um, Mystical actually said put together a decentralized auditing committee to open up that allow them to open up um that to use a multi-sig feature um to open up certain transaction only when they prove uh, it's proven to be illegal for example the user journey would be that let's say OFAC found a illegal transaction on mystical for example a hacker is using mystical to hide his money then OFAC should issue a official subpoena or official um documents and send it to the decentralized committee of mystical um, which will comprise of different stakeholder, different interests of uh, the party to that could balance the decision if they should reveal this particular transaction. And for and and once they do, um this auditing committee, which might be comprised of over five people, and they need to pass a majority vote to decide if they want to reveal this transaction. So once they decided to reveal it, that they will use their own private key, which um to 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 open up. The, the transaction, that particular transaction history to the authority while keeping the other transaction private. So in this design, we hope that we could uh, make sure that the users and um, we could hope that users, uh, the general users could be, um, the general users' privacy could be protected. However, it could be a, a mechanism to scare all this illegal transaction away and also making sure that there's, the, there's a continued healthy privacy environment for um, the Web3 transaction future. Um, so basically, that's um, that's a quick intro of what Mystical is. So for the next step, I would like to share like um, and um, the, the life demo of Mystical, because Mystical, although um, Mystical has been live since April this year, and we have already welcomed 100k transaction on our network and with um and with like over uh 100 with 30 30k user unique user on our, on our website so if any um partners here or any wallets exchange etc would be interested in adding more privacy feature for your users don't hesitate to reach out um and uh, i will i will I, I didn't put any contact number in the slide but you could always reach out to a hash key for the contact number of mystical so um feel free to reach out anytime and now um i'm going to share a video just a really quick one to showcase how to deposit privately deposit your assets into mystical um as um, the way to show like this like uh, this product. Give me one second. Um, there we go. So this video might not have background music. So if you have any question regarding my introduction, feel free to also write down and and uh, reach out anytime.
I guess this demo has been a little bit too long. So if you want more information about Mystical and how it's actually um, um, work, feel free to check out our website and there will be a, a testnet demo and a mainnet demo for your reference. And um, there will be also like live statistics about Mystical and uh, to show you like how is it performing. So um, you, you probably have a better experience in understanding how Mystical is. Um, by using those website. Um, and if you're during those process, if you have any question, don't hesitate to reach out. So yeah, basically that's what Mystical is. It's kind of a bit of here and there, but um, feel free to ask me question if you have any. I'm more than happy to answer it right now. Perfect, thank you, Bagnia. I think we'll save the Q&A through tags if that's okay. Mm -hmm. So we can yeah, perfect. on to totally. the next person. Awesome. Really appreciate your so time. Much. Next we have Range Protocol.